All new at six, a dog is back home tonight after a scare on the water. Yeah, the owner says his corgi went overboard while on their way north on the Indian River in Brevard County. But don't let those little tiny legs fool you. As News 6's Carolina Cardona found out, this corgi can doggy paddle. The owner of the one-year-old Corgi tells me they were on their boat heading north along the intercoastal waterway near Merritt Island when they realized that the dog was no longer on their boat. She was later found in Rockledge, about seven miles away. There was no question it was her, and uh, a very big sigh of relief, and it was a very emotional moment. John Atwood is feeling lucky to have his beloved dog by his side after she went overboard in the waters of the Indian River. She's like a Velcro dog. She's always at my side. Um, and so she'd been in and out of my lap all day. On Sunday afternoon, his dog named Jessica was with him while traveling from Fort Pierce with his mom and stepdad on their boat. She got up, went down to get a drink of water. A few minutes later, I had actually gone to the back of the boat to take video of dolphins playing in the wake and realized she wasn't at my feet. She wasn't at his feet or on the boat as they passed the intercoastal waterway near Merritt Island. When we couldn't locate her, we immediately put two small boats in the water and started canvassing the water to try and find her. But their search ended without Jessica. More than 24 hours later, John got the news she'd been found. She swam a very long way. The one-year-old corgi somehow made it to the shore of a residential neighborhood in Rockledge and ended up in the backyard of a home. The homeowner contacted John after he saw his Facebook post, a post that got more than 1,800 shares. I just want to say thank you. Thank you for caring. Thank you for being kind. And thank you for being compassionate. When you guys reunite, what was that like? I don't even know how to put it into words. <laughs> what were those 26 hours like for you? Uh, horribly painful. A painful experience now over. Jessica is once again enjoying the boat life and cuddles from her human. She's now going to be always on her leash. On a leash for the duration of their trip up to North Carolina. In Brevard County, Carolina Cardona, News 6. I, we are all sitting here projecting our own dogs <laughs> missing for 26 hours on the water. That is insane how far that little corgi I know. swam. Oh my gosh, but she was gonna make it back home. She's got a good life on the boat. She does. She, and she knew it. <laughs> I'm so happy Oof, that they, fa I man. saw that email yesterday and I panicked it and then when they, it really was, but Jessica's okay everyone. Happy ending. We could relax.